dear students today we will study the nerve system of rat so nerve system of rat is somewhat similar to the nerve system of scleroderma with little difference scleroderma is aquatic animal it belongs to the class spices and rat is a terrestrial animal it belongs to the class mammalia so here the nerve system of a rat in today's lecture we'll study in detail so you listen here carefully and try to understand what is the nerve system so the system in our body which functions under the control of brain so in our body in all organs up to the tissue and cells there are fine and fine nerves supply so due to that nerves we can sense the touch whenever our body is touch so we are feeling the somewhat it touching to our body so the nerves from here that gives a message to the brain somebody or something is touching to your body sense of touch sense of hearing sense of vision sense of smell so each and every activity is under the control of brain and that is due to the nerves so we have to study the nerve system of scleroderma nerve system of rat so in each in each and every system <coughs> there is the main organ in that system and that function of main organ is to play the main role for example heart is the main organ of circulatory system under the control of heart circulatory system sir functioning similarly in the nerve system the brain is the main organ of the nerve system in the reproductive system the gonad male gonad or female gonad is the main organ of that system so similarly in today's lecture today's period nerve system of rat remember brain is the main organ of this system so here we are studying the nerve system so we should divide the nerve system in three parts this is the first this is the second this is the third so nerve system includes what includes nerve system includes central nervous system peripheral nervous system and autonomous nervous system so nerve system is divided into three parts then we will see the central nervous system so in central nervous system remember there is the brain the main organ of system <coughs> and spinal cord spinal cord which is present in our vertebral column patisha mankya madhe jo asto majja rujju that is called as the spinal cord which is a part from the brain runs backwards towards the tail side spinal cord so central nervous system includes brain and spinal cord then peripheral nervous system this it includes the cranial nerves and spinal nerves then autonomous nervous system that includes sympathetic and parasympathetic nerves and ganglia remember when we are studying the nerve system of any animal then for easy study or for systematic study that system is divided into three parts or it includes three parts first is the central nervous system second is the peripheral nervous system and third one is the autonomous nervous system <coughs> in further study central nervous system includes the brain and the spinal cord 
Peripheral nerve system include cranial nerves and spinal nerves. Autonomous nerve system include sympathetic and parasympathetic nerves and ganglion. Nerves and ganglion. Now we will study the brain. So brain is the main part of the nerve system. The location of brain is in the head. Here, in the head. It is protected by the skull. Thin and very tough bone. Thin and very tough bone. Hard bones are protected. The brain. So we can say brain is present in the skull. Or brain box which is very hard, which protects the brain because it is very, very important organ in the body. Under the control of the brain, complete body is functioning. So brain is further divided into forebrain, midbrain and hindbrain. Forebrain means the, again it is called as the Prosensiferon, midbrain, mesensiferon, and hindbrain, rhombensiferon. So, again, further, the forebrain includes different parts, midbrain includes different parts, and hindbrain includes different parts. In the notes, you can study detail. So, when you are the studying the brain, then we have given the figure, structure. So, dorsal structure and ventral structure. Dorsal view and ventral view, we have to sketch, we have to draw the figure and show the labeling which further divided parts, labelings. Again, the next part is the spinal cord. So, this is spinal cord, spinal cord, spinal cord is a part of central nervous system. Spinal cord is the part of central nervous system. So from the brain towards the backbone, the medulla oblongata, medulla oblongata, that is the posterior most part of the brain. So the part of central nervous system starts from medulla oblongata, passes backwards and extends into the tail at the end of the animal's tail. So that is called as the spinal cord. Aplia Sirena Madhe, brain cha jo posterior most part hai, medulla oblongata, that runs backwards up to the tail, here up to the end of the backbone. So in that backbone, the parts of the brain that is called as the spinal cord. So from the medulla oblongata up to the last bone of vertebral column, in between that, in the center that, so a spinal cord is present. And from that spinal cord, different nerves are, different nerves to our abdomen, towards the backside. Spinal cord, person, as a spinal cord, this is the spinal cord. And from that, like this nerves, nerves. So these nerves are towards the abdomen towards the kidney, towards the different organs from the, from the spinal cords. In notes you can uh, study in deep. So, in today's period, we have studied the nerve system. Nerve system includes central nervous system, peripheral nervous system, autonomous nervous system. Then, central nervous system further includes the brain and the spinal cord. Then peripheral nerve system include cranial and spinal nerves and autonomous nerve system include sympathetic and parasympathetic nerves. Here in your syllabus, the brain and spinal cord is given for the detailed study. So we have, we have studied the brain, brain further divided into forebrain, midbrain and hindbrain, prosensiferon, mesensiferon and rhombensiferon and having different parts. Then a spinal cord, which is the part of the Medulla oblongata, part of the central nervous system starts from the medulla oblongata, 
and passes backwards and extends into the tail. So here today we have studied the nerve system of rat and in nerve system we have studied the brain of rat, dorsal view and ventral view and spinal cord. In the notes you can study the figure also. Here it is a very hard to sketch the figure. The time limit is there and limitation of the bones are also. So dear students, for today it is sufficient and in next period we will complete the syllabus. Ata ek shivar se period hoi ante se antara apna syllabus purna jala asa apan declare karna hai. Tumhara mi WhatsApp guru parthi test tutorial sati prashna patho le lai. कॉलेज मध्ये गवई सर कडे एक टेस्ट ट्युटोरियल ची नोटबुक मिळते त्या नोटबुक मध्ये टेस्ट ट्युटोरियल लिहून आणायचे एकच नोटबुक बनवायची तुम्हाला गवई सर भेटले नाही कॉलेज मधली वही जर परचेस करता आली टेस्ट ट्युटोरियल ची तर तुम्ही साधे कागद आणि वरून जे आहे त्या टेस्ट ट्युटोरियल चे फ्रंट कव्हर त्याचे झेरॉक्स अटॅच करायचं आणि स्वतः तुम्ही घरी सुद्धा वही बनवू शकता आणि त्याच्यामध्ये टेस्ट फर्स्ट त्याच्यानंतर ट्युटोरियल फर्स्ट त्याच्यानंतर टेस्ट सेकंड आणि त्याच्यानंतर ट्युटोरियल सेकंड असे चार क्वेश्चन दिलेले आहेत ते चार क्वेश्चन लिहून तुम्हाला व्हॉट्सअप वरती जसं मेसेज पाठवलं आहे त्यानुसार ते माझ्याकडे कॉलेजमध्ये आणून सबमिट करायचं आहे आयज आली आहे पॉसिबल विथ इन थ्री डेज फ्रॉम टुडे कालपासून चार दिवस दिलेले होते आता राहिलेले तीन दिवस सो फॉर टुडे इट इज सफिशंट थँक्यू व्हेरी मच धन्यवाद